Welcome back everyone, I'm Heather from Speedhead. And I'm Cody from Maverick Fitness. This is our first video in our fitness series for the month of May. Um, Cody, what do we want to talk about in this video? Today we're going to talk about keeping the knees healthy um, and talking about knee pain, which so many people deal with, especially skiers. Like and um, <laughs> we're going to talk about some quick fixes and some exercises that you can do at home as well as in the gym um, to restore the strength balance back to your knees and um, make them feel better. This is one of my favorite exercises that he's going to show coming, coming up here. Um, it helped me huge recovering from knee surgery and so I'm, I know it will help a lot of you guys out there who are wanting to get back into your sports for the summer. I also want to introduce Emma, our lovely model for today. <laughs> She's modeling an outfit from the store. Um, Emma, why did you choose this outfit? Um, I chose this one because I love the fitting of the shirt. Another high cut. Or sorry. High, low, low cut. <laughs> <laughs> um, these tights are awesome. Heather's sporting them as well. They've got these wonderful pockets in them and they're just great for working out because they dry super quick. And they stay up, they don't fall down, which is awesome. The door at the end. Definitely placebo. Yeah, so stay tuned. Well, I'll show you the workout now. Hey guys, here's two quick exercises that you can do at home to help take care of your knees and reduce pain. So uh, most knee pain that we see, with, uh, that we deal with, with skiers, hikers, and bikers, it comes down to a strength imbalance between the outside of the leg and the inside of the leg. And more specifically, the outside of the leg is very strong with all the activities that, uh, that we see people doing in Nelson, and the inside of the leg gets weak. So it creates um, tension on the patella and knee pain. So we're gonna show you an exercise for this muscle on the inside of the knee called the VMO. What I'm gonna have Emma do is she's gonna step, step on top of this foam roller. And if you guys wanna do this at home, you can just stack up some books. We've given uh, this to clients who've gone home and they've used books. Then she's gonna take her opposite leg and she's gonna step up with it. So we want something underneath the heel that's about three inches. So she should have about a three inch heel rise. She's gonna bring her opposite heel in line with her toe. She's gonna to put her hands on her hips and she's just dropping straight down without putting any weight through the heel and then right back up. So the VMO is very active in this range of motion. And remember, this is the primary stabilizer of the knee. It prevents the knee from caving in and from collapsing. Um, so it's something that we want to really strengthen, especially before we go out skiing and hiking. Um, yeah, so keep going. She's gonna do about 15 to 20 reps. You wanna feel it right through here as you come down and then all the way back up. So once again, no pressure through this foot. This leg's doing all the work. Very simple exercise that you guys can do at home. We've given it to many, many people and it's helped them resolve knee pain and uh, correct any imbalances in the knee. Okay guys, this is the second exercise. This is one that we've actually been having Emma doing on a regular basis to help her with her squats and um, strengthen her legs for better performance from her lower body. So the first exercise, we were focusing on the top uh, range of motion. Now we're gonna focus on uh, range of motion in the bottom. So what I'm gonna have Emma do is she's gonna step her opposite leg well behind her. Back heel is lifted up off the floor. We're gonna start with this knee straight. She's gonna have her hands by her sides, focusing on keeping her shoulders right over her hips. She's gonna gently brace with her uh, stomach and ab muscles. And then what she's gonna do is she's gonna come down and forward. She's gonna maintain her balance. And so she's coming down and forward. We're just gonna pause there, okay? So I know what you guys are thinking. The knee is coming over the toe. That's okay. That's what we want. That's what's gonna strengthen uh, the VMO muscle. So she's gonna come back up. I'm gonna have her do eight reps in a row. So we wanna go down, taking about three seconds. Three, two, one, straight back up. All of the weight is in the center of the foot. Guys, this is one of the best exercises that you can do if you're a skier, if you're a hiker, to strengthen your knees, to keep them healthy for the uh, long period, for, for the rest of your life, excuse me. So we see so many people from uh, all the skiing that they're doing, they're very strong through the outside of the leg and they're a lot weaker through the inside of the leg. So we wanna correct that and it's gonna clear up any pain in the knee and it's just gonna help stabilize them over, over the long run. So that's really good, she's coming down. I wanna make sure the uh, knee is tracking over the second toe. So I'm just gonna put my hand against her knee. <laughs> Apply a little resistance, go ahead and come on back up. 
resistance. And then I'm going to get her to push against my knee as she comes down. Yeah, there we go. Good, back up. So about three sets of 10 to 12 at home. You guys can do it on a flat floor, or you can, we usually stack something up like this, but you don't have to. You, you can definitely just do this one on a flat ground. Three sets of 10 to 12 reps, and that will really help get your legs in shape. Thanks for tuning in, you guys. Uh, this is the first video in our series. We've got three more coming your way this month. And actually, uh, for the month of May, Village Ski Hut is offering 15% off all our new spring arrivals. So come on up and we're happy to see you um, and outfit you for the summer and all your activities. Yeah guys, thanks for watching and uh, if you want to come down and check us out, you can look at us online at maverickfitness.com yep. or you can come down or right by Home Hardware on Lakeside Drive and uh, if you guys have any questions or you want to get in shape for your summer activities mm -hmm. or just help with uh, energy, anything, yep. we're, we're here to help so feel free to check us out. Thanks, see you next time.